Whoa, we certainly have the biggest Rapunzel star I've ever... Maximus, what are you doing here? We have the Disney Princess Rapunzel. Whoa, don't tell me. We have a Play-Doh set to play with that includes Sparkle Play-Doh. Wow, look at that tower. That looks awesome. You guys, today we're going to play with Rapunzel's Garden Tower. And it even comes with a Rapunzel. Let's open it up and play together. All right, let's see what we have inside. Uh, a super cool mold that's part of the tower. Wow, we have roses and flowers, everything that just should go in Rapunzel's hair. I wonder, oh, it does open up. Then we have, oh, the lanterns and urns and, of course, Pascal. We have um, flowers in her paint set, paintbrushes, and Maximus. We have a mold for you, too. Whoa, that's super cool. I like it. All right, let's see if we can pull out anything else from here from this side. Nope, we got to open the other side to get everything else that's out. Open it up. All right. Um, I think I know what this is. That's right. It's the top of the tower. Um, what else is in here? Cool beans, guys. We have three different molds, and they all have glitter in it. So we have gold because you know for Hunzel's hair. Then it looks like we have this uh, pretty blue kind of aqua color. And, of course, Rapunzel's color is purple, so we've got to have purple. And then, hmm, this looks like it's going to make her super long hair, because it's a braid. That's cool. Let's see what we have here. A mat, so we can play on this mat. Let's see what the mats are about. Oh, cool, everyone. It's just a Disney princess mat, and we have Rapunzel's tower can go there. <gasps> Cool, and Belle's um, Play-Doh set can go there, Sleeping Beauty's place I can go there, and Ariel's place I can go there. I like it. Wow, that'll make it really fun to play with our Play-Doh. And last, of course, we got to get this Rapunzel out so we can start playing with a Play-Doh. So we got it out, and whoa, look everyone, we can mix and match her dress with all the other princesses. So we can mix and match with Belle or Ariel or Aurora. Wow, look at Air, um, Rapunzel's beautiful hair cascading down the back. And she has her little hand up going, uh-huh, Flynn Rider. Kind of like our friend Maximus always has that kind of curious look. So we have um, underneath and we can make a beautiful dress for her. I like it. Wow. Let's start playing. We have our play mat all set up, and let's first play with her hair because her hair is so gorgeous. So we are going to take out this yellow color. Oh, it's so soft and beautiful, you guys. This is awesome. Okay, so I'm going to put that flat out. and You know what? I'm just going to use the container. If you don't have any Play-Doh like a rolling pin or whatever. Um, it doesn't matter. You can always improvise with what they give you. So I'm going to have, um, see, I'm just rolling this out. Let's get rid of that kind of crease right there. And you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and turn this over so it's nice and beautiful. Next, here is her hair, okay? So do you see the little kind of spindles there? That's where Rapunzel is going to help us out. It just snaps right into the bottom, just like that, and I'm going to roll it over. Here we go, you guys. Let's go this way so you can see. Ready? I'm going to push down fairly hard. Whoa! Keep going! Keep going! Cool! Look at that! Alright, now I'm going to take it off. Perfect. And I'm going to unroll it now. Look at that. That is so cool. So what we can do is, is we can have it coming down from the tower, just like that. So we need to go a little bit more. So I'm going to do it again. Here we go. 
push down and make sure Ooh, I like that one better look at that one just stays right there perfect it didn't have all that design though that I want so let's try that again over here with the, the thickest part here we go I'm gonna go hard oh, perfect do it again really hard awesome okay now we have some of that design that we're looking for in the braid there it is all right so if you don't succeed try try again so we have that and I'm gonna put this right behind there and fasten it and oh look at perfect now her hair is coming down from the Play-Doh Tower. Speaking of Play-Doh Tower, we need a tower up there. So I'm gonna take this cone and we can either, you know, just put it on top, just like this, kind of hold that into place, or we can decorate it. I say that we decorate it. Let's put some vines on there. So I'm gonna take this kind of aqua color here and kind of has some green in it so that can work out really good and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna roll it just like that that's super awesome and I am going to kind of mold it in between what they have already so you can kind of see let me take the point off there so it can fit good I'm gonna mold it right in there and um, we'll get that Perfect. I'll put that in and it's going to look really, really pretty. So here we go. Perfect. These molds are perfect because they're way deep. We have the vines growing on her tower and I'm glad that her hair fell off because we need to put some beautiful flowers on it. Don't you think? All right. So we are going to take the purple. This purple is, you know, her color and I'm going to roll it up. Perfect. And I'm going to measure it against maybe one of these. Let's do one of the back so we don't ruin some of the vines there. Oh, pretty. I like these choices better. So I'm going to go ahead and push it in there just like so and take it out. So do you see the flower? Ooh, pretty. It comes off really easy because these molds are super good. And I'm going to put it right on her hair. So we'll do that. A um, couple times and maybe we'll do a different flower this time so I'm gonna kind of roll it up again push it in here kind of flatten it real good you can kind of see that I'm loving this play-doh with all the sparkles in it and then we have a really pretty flower so we'll take that out and put it right there on the seam so people can't see it I think we need one more you guys what do you think so I'm going to roll it up and I'm going to go place it in. Perfect. And take it out. And you know what we need to do before we put the hair, look at that, before we put the hair back on, let's open this up and see what kind of molds we also can do. Uh, yeah, we need to do Pascal, uh, don't you think? I think so. So Pascal, of course, we'll get this green. That one has a little bit of yellow in it, so we'll take it out. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to roll it up. And Pascal isn't really that big, so I'm going to just take a little bit more like this. Perfect. I'm going to take this ball, and I'm going to place it right in here. Let's do this side. Flatten it out. I'm going to take some of this excess uh, blade excess <laughs> away and I am going to smoosh this together. Smoosh, smoosh, smoosh. Hopefully we get a good Pascal. Let's open it. Let's open this up. Uh, awesome. Perfect. Wow, you guys, look at that Pascal. Perfect. You can even see his um, little spirally tail there. Hmm, let's see, let's close this up. Let's put our tower back on. Let's see if, yep, he sure can. Let's put Pascal right here on the balcony so he's waiting 
for Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. And we're going to go ahead and put her hair back up. And I think we need a little bit more hair. Um, so let's go ahead and do that real fast and put those flowers right back on. Her tower is looking really pretty. Now we're going to take off her braid. And what we can do is, is we can put Rapunzel at the top or we can decorate her dress and we can decorate her dress however it is that we want. If we want to put some flowers on it, uh, if we want to put a crown on it, we can decorate however we want. So there's so much fun things that we can do with this Play-Doh set. I sure hope you had a fun time playing it with us today. This is such a fun Play-Doh set for Rapunzel's Garden Tower. And if you haven't already, click way up there to subscribe here and subscribe to the engineering family. We would love it. And if you tell us in the comments, we'll be able to say thank you. Also, don't forget to like the video. And in true engineering family protocol, we have a very secret password. And that password is right down there. And it is going to be, that's right, Play-Doh, P-L-A-Y-D-O-H. I mean, you can spell it however you want, but the secret password is Play-Doh. I hope you have lots of fun today. Bye, everyone. Now take a look at one of these cool videos that feature surprise eggs, Scooby-Doo, Paw Patrol, and even Jack Frost and Elsa going to jail. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.